Hey guys, well, I'm out in the shop today. Uh, here lately I've been really busy with the uh, new screen sets, so I haven't really had much time out in the shop. But today I'm out here and I'm going to be machining some parts. And uh, I'm going to be trying out my new coolant tube. Now this coolant tube, my buddy Wyatt designed and made for me. Um, it's real nice. He made this bracket so that it back mounts right here in the factory uh, holes that were already on the Precision Matthews. Uh, we've got a 3 8 half MPT right here and then it's got a 4 quarter MPT nozzles. Uh, I've currently got it set up with a 10 millimeter nozzle uh, and 3 50 millimeter nozzles. But it looks really nice now. It's only four nozzles, so I don't have quite as much volume as I did with the coolant ring. However, even though the coolant ring worked really well, it just doesn't work with the ATC because when it slides in, the tool slides in, it hits it. So we had to have something that would uh, be compatible with the ATC. So you can see the new coolant ring working really well here. It gets really, uh, it really does get a sufficient flow, I think, straight on the tool with the four nozzles. Doing some drilling here. Nice heavy string. And it seems to be working really good for chip evacuation. I will be offering these coolant tubes on the website, so if you're interested in one of these coolant tubes, stop by the website and check those out. Also, I have a few of these coolant rings that I machined a while back, and they're also available on the website. Uh, the coolant ring has six nozzles, as you can see here. One is for an air blast uh, to kind of clear the chips, and the other five are for flood coolant. Of course, it's magnetic, so it just uh, magnetically rests up on your machine there. And it's easy to take off and mount if you need it uh, to remove it for any reasons. All right, guys, I'm going to continue to do some work out here in the shop. But if you're interested in one of these coolant rings, or if you're interested in the new coolant tube that my buddy Wyatt's making, stop by the website and uh, check those out. Guys, thanks for watching the videos. If you're new to my channel and you're just tuning in, like the video content, click on the subscribe button down below. When I post a new video, they'll send you a link, and if it's something you're interested in, you can stop by and check it out. As always, guys, please feel free to ask questions, make suggestions, or leave comments. Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe, and most importantly, be safe.